Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe here at Fino Boxing, like this video, and leave your comments down below. And follow us at all our social media platforms at Fino Boxing, and my personal one is at Adriana underscore sports. Well, you, right now you're, uh, you're at the 154 pound division, and uh, that's, that's definitely a, a division that's stacked with talent. We obviously know of the champs in uh, Jason Rosario, uh, Golden Boy's very own you know, Teixeira, and of course, Charlo. Um, do you see yourself in the future, assuming the weight class, the, the fighters stay within that weight class? Do you see yourself in vision already um, fighting some of those champions at some point in your career? A hundred percent. Yeah, a hundred percent. That's if some of them obviously stay the way. Um, and I don't, I mean, by the time I get there, um, probably sure those titles are going to be tossed around left and right, just because I feel like some of those champions aren't going to be ones that are, how would you say, like are going to be securing that weight class. Like Canelo is the one that secures the weight class. Heard was securing the weight class. I mean, so you fought J-Rock. Um, but you have those people that, you know, are just dominant in that weight class that you can, you, you know, they're going to be holding the titles for a while. But yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to fighting. Whoever has the belt, I'm going for it. So. Well, that, that specific division has, was crazy the past few months with uh, mm-hmm. Hurd and then uh, Julian Williams and then yeah. Jason Rosario taking that. And then uh, obviously Tony Harrison, uh, Jamal yeah. Charlo yeah. taking uh-huh. it back. Charlo takes it back. <laughs> the Teixeira yeah, comes yeah. along. So it, it uh-huh. definitely is, uh, um, it's been tossed around quite a bit the past few months. So we'll see, when, you know, when, 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 it, when it's your time, who will be there. Um, mm-hmm. But at this point right now with the champions that I mentioned at 154, who do you believe is the top dog in that division? Right now, I would say, um, based off of natural ability and just skill-wise, is uh, Charlo. Charlo is definitely the one that um, has more ability than them um higher power higher iq and just a little bit more just power he has a little bit more of that dog in him um that some of these fighters kind of lack um sure just, he i mean he had an impressive performance uh but two of the guy that he fought um definitely hit like the 180 and like on how he normally performs so that was good for him congrats to him um but yeah charlo's definitely the one that's uh the guy that has it right now all right well we'll see what happens in that division? Like I said, it's been a crazy few months. Um, and of course, we wait for your return back inside the ring. Hopefully, this pandemic starts to, you know, turn things around and we can slowly go back to normal. We look forward uh-huh. to seeing you inside the ring again. Thank you so much for taking the time to talk to us. I wish mm-hmm. you the best of luck and, and, and all the health so you can uh, continue training and, and stay ready for your next fight. All right. Thank you. Stay safe out there. Thank you so much for your time. Thank, thank you. you. Take care. Uh-huh. All right. All right. All right. Bye-bye. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe here at Fino Boxing. Like this video and leave your comments down below. And follow us at all our social media platforms at Fino Boxing. And my personal one is at Adriana underscore sports.